Well, this is a very close race. Like you said, Patrick, still one precinct not reporting and Crowley is up just over 1000 votes, although hours ago he did announce his acceptance and Chris Abley endorsed him as well. But State Senator Chris Larson calls those declarations premature at this point. He is waiting it out. Both Crowley and Larson said if elected, they would immediately tackle health care during coronavirus first and then move on to their plan with the county as a whole, but both tonight told me they do understand that coronavirus played a huge role in these voting results. We were trying to bring more people together. Uh, I think that where I, where I come from and the vision and the experience, um, but also the work that I've put in into this community for the past 15, 16 years uh, has shown. And I think many people uh, who didn't know me did their research and those who knew me uh, went to back for me to make sure that we won this race. And so I think at the end of the day, a lot of folks were ready to see somebody fresh, somebody new. For us, as a grassroots campaign, we rely on a lot of um, voters to go door to door and knock individually to be able to have conversations with folks. And obviously, for the last three, four weeks, we weren't able to do that. And so what we saw was just a flood of money uh, coming on in from, from Abley, who is clearly trying to, to hide something in Milwaukee County. And again, we're still waiting for the final results. Caroline, do we know which area is not reporting yet? We know there are uncounted absentee votes in Wauwatosa, Patrick, and I just spoke to a representative with Larson's campaign. They say that they are looking into a possibility of a recount at this point.